Cancer, yo, how are you? Welcome to your general reading. My name's Clive, you're watching Emirates Tarot. Okay, it's a pleasure to be here and read for you. If this reading baffles you in any way or it doesn't resonate, this not for you. Okay, maybe a later video will be, but this one won't be. All right, I hope you'll stick around. If you require a personal reading, please feel free to contact me on the email below this video. All right, it is there. If it's not readily apparent, click the more button. So without further ado, what's going on for my Cancerian friends? What's going on for my Cancerian friends? You have the Ace of Cups, something new, something old, something blue. Whoa. Decisions, decisions, decisions. The underlying energy to this is whether to give up your present situation to follow this through. In the past, there's somebody from, somebody's been ignoring you, okay? Not necessarily an ex, but somebody's been ignoring you after a fallout, okay? Or you've been ignoring somebody's advances here. But uh, there's a finally, a, there's a final kind of giving way and succumbing to the situation and saying okay let's talk all right this is playing havoc with emotions okay probably starting off as a friendship but there's been a, a resistance to somebody's advances here okay somebody needed to take time out to slow things down to think about it but all of a sudden there's going to be a very quick change in attitudes in in the situation with the tower here. I'm kind of getting you're the one that's going to instigate this. And I'm getting that you're the one that's been ignoring somebody's advances because of the past. Right. It's like you've been busy with their other things. You've not wanted to know the situation. You've not wanted to know this person. But then you think, oh God, I'll give it a go. Wow. Then you can have focus. But there's got to be certain changes. Okay, so regardless of who you're dealing with, whether you're dealing with a past person, an ex, whatever, all right, or even a new person coming in, you know, it's kind of like you want to dictate the way it goes. You've learned your lesson. You know, and if the person you're dealing with has been very overzealous a bit, you're kind of, or a bit pushy, you're uh, saying, whoo, slow down. Slow down. We need to do this properly. All right. You're taking control, that's for sure. You see in the bigger picture. You perhaps see this person as being very controlling. Now, this may not necessarily be an ex. It may not be somebody new. This could be a partner. All right. But it's 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 a general reading, okay? Take it to your particular situation you know there's no real specifics here on the person you're dealing with right but there's somebody here you're in the energy of taking control you want you've wised up to whatever's been going on okay and you're making a big decision here all right you're kind of giving way but you're controlling it yeah there's the energy of a third party situation well like i say regardless of your situation their situation the energy is the same there is kind of room for celebration but under the surface of that happiness all right which many of you may be inclined to just jump in because of your feelings this is kind of saying you know, think about it. But I'm kind of getting here. There's been a... The person you've been dealing with, is, is, there's a... There's been a change of tactics. There's been a change of... Attitude here. But... Now we're getting kind of forward motion... Mm, four of swords 
you know it, it is a pretty restricted situation this is this is why your hesitancy i'm kind of getting a lot of you don't want to get involved with this or you know you there's a discovery here that you know the person you're dealing with you maybe thought they were single now there's an attachment um this could be to a child you know but there's there's a conversation here taking place on getting where there's there's a discovery all right and this changes everything for you right so all of a sudden you've <coughs> you're kind of playing coy cautious you need time to think about this hmm some of these influences are outside of your control, so beware of trying to control everything. Okay. It is Aries energy. You could be dealing with an Aries. If not, don't worry about it. It's, it's just that energy around you. All right. There's the Empress going forward. So this is being self-aware. Mm-hmm. Choices of the heart. It's serious consideration to who you actually want to be with. Okay. And where you want to be. There is this kind of energy. The situation is calming down. I'm kind of getting there's a... There's like a... After a lot of arguments, there's, a, there's peace and harmony. Okay. But you're, you're... There's this energy of weighing up the pros and cons here. You know, making comparisons between two people, some of you. Wow. There is success here. Okay. You finally got somebody to listen to you. Ooh. Mm. Oh, now we've got Pisces energy. Well, it's getting complicated, okay? But to simplify matters, all right. You're coming out with your true intentions. You're coming out with your thoughts and feelings, or whatever they are. So are they. So there's an opening up here with the moon card and tower. There's a sudden opening up after, you know, the silent treatment or whatever. But whoever's been giving you the silent treatment, or if you've been giving them the silent treatment, like I said at the start of the video, I'm kind of getting you've been ignoring them. So all of a sudden there's an opening up and you're saying, right, this is what I want. This is what I'm going to do. It's like you're throwing down the gauntlet. It's like you're throwing down the ultimatum. But majority of you I'm kind of getting, sort of giving this person a chance, you know, to see where it leads to. But there is a decision here. But you're certainly in control. You're holding back any real commitment. There's a lot of self-restraint here with you. You're dealing with a lot of different energies. You know, we've got Pisces energy, Taurus energy, Sagittarius energy, Aries energy. <sighs> a lot of different energies. Of course, there is a marriage involved in this. Okay. At least on paper. And energetically. Or a long-term commitment. But... Uh, Oh dear. Some of you are contemplating walking away with what you can walk away with. I'm kind of getting here. This is this is a a separation, a, a divorce. It's there's a lot of pent up emotions about the situation, you know, and you've been waiting for some news, the news coming in and then you're acting. But there's a, there's, there's a lot of self love here and you're doing what's right for you. Not anybody else. But there's also, you've you've got pressure here from somebody who is perhaps married. All right. And there's a third party involvement. There's probably kind of kids here. 
for some of you and it's it's wondering what to do you some of you are in the silent mode you're waiting for developments you're waiting for this person to respond i'm getting they will respond okay or come in sooner or later but uh you're kind of in this energy of you know you're using all your wisdom and experience with this person it's it's a question of where do your loyalties lie do you want this extra responsibility because this emperor is all about taking on responsibility mm, i'm gonna leave it there thanks very much for watching